Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. So then, now that stuff is uh, kinda unlocked around these parts, I think I'll do another once over and see what might be there waiting for us, shall we? Oh, of course we have. We, we always have way too many moons. Thank you for chasing away the Bowser Monsters minions, kind traveler. I wonder where our lock lady dress is. I hope whoever wears it looks good enough in it to justify our heartache. And there's, you can get some hints here, but for now, but for now, let's just go around and take a peek. See, is a seaside kingdom intriguing? Hmm, intriguing indeed. Uh, I don't believe there's anything new around this first area type place here. I'm just kind of, just kind of taking a peek see just to be sure, just to be sure. Oh, I see Cat Mario down there in that corner now, but <laughs> maybe that was there before. Uh, oh yeah, I did. I don't need to go down there right now. <laughs> Cleared out those zippers and stuff like that, so I'm just gonna go ahead and boink. Eh, kind of a mini prize of sorts. Anyway, let's go up the newfangled stairs and we'll see a portrait hmm yeah definitely take a picture of it I definitely have pictures of all these already so I don't have to <laughs> but yeah it's hinting at something here and that certainly looks like a certain cascade kingdom type place so hmm hmm remember that for later got it good I made up well, that's that, that's fine. That's fine. I was gonna go do some Goomba stacking. Act oh, actually, oh, I may may have messed that up. Um, I wanted to do Goomba stacking, but I think I may have gotten the stacks a little. Uh, I should have kept the singles individual because the Goombas they can't jump very high, so you gotta kind of lead them around to place. Eh! Fine, I'll do it like that. <laughs> ah, there we go. You gotta lead them around the places that you can actually get on top of them from. Like, say, if I were to go, oink, yeah, there you go. What's the point of doing this anyway? Well, first of all, there's these, of course. Four beautiful water drop, well, it's actually more like scale-shaped things. And, <laughs> and then we go over here, if you'd like to. And just go ahead and, actually, I don't even have to... Uh, I think I, I think I got the Goomba stack a little too big, guys. <laughs> yeah, I'll grab this heart, though. Okay, so let's see if I can actually get the rest of these blocks here. <laughs> okay, there we go. And now I don't think I need the Goomba stack any longer for this moment in time. If I, oh wait, wait, wait a second. Is she over? Is Goombet over at... No, she's not. Yeah, because you have to get Goombas down and around somewhere there, if I recall correctly. Yeah, I'll save it. <laughs> for now, here's Lakitu. Oh, it's time for fishing. Pick up big one on the line. Alright, so big one indeed here. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Hmm? Hmm? Uh? You gonna bite ever? Oh. 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 Yeah, it's a moon. Who would have guessed? <laughs> Lake fishing. And I do believe the other ones are just for coins like they were before. It's always the big one that you want to go for, it seems like. It's like the power moon gives the fish unprecedented size. Mm. Yeah, just coins. Okay, so I'm gonna go down here now. I know I said that I was gonna do these sorts of dealios later, but this one, this one's a little, little different. So look at it. Doesn't that look familiar? Yeah, it's back to the Sand Kingdom for another moon. It's it's amazing. I know. <laughs> this place is uh, actually pretty handy to unlock because you can use this to kind of get a vantage point of a whole series of stuff over here. Yeah, you can't get here normally, other than without the painting. Southwestern Floating Island, then... Secret Path to Tostarina. <laughs> and over here you can get coins just by doing this with your hats. <laughs> it is bonus town in the sky here. But yeah, you can take a look-see around and see what you might have missed and stuff like that. You can see actually see the glowing bird from here. See it going behind the... 
uh, Jaxi poison building there. Well, it's, it's already behind there now, but you'll see it come out eventually. Oh, there it is. It's looping around. Okay, yeah. But yeah, you can also, you know, jump down here and get to... Well, I guess I was going to say get to a decent amount of places, but maybe not. It's, it's kind of far away from... <laughs> there are other high locations like this in the game that you have to get to by paintings. As a matter of fact, there's a place really nearby to where I'm going to pop out here that has uh, a, a, like a painting-specific uh, thing to get to. So I'm going to have to save that until I reach said painting later. Boy, you are looking fabulous there, Goomba. Yes, with your veil. <laughs> uh, but yeah, up over... On top of there, see where that arrow is? It's higher than that. That is uh, another place you get to with a painting. Anyway, I'm gonna go up over to here and grab the zipper. Okay. <laughs> and a bonus to boot just because. With fanfare. Woo! <laughs> End of the hidden passage. Pretty easy, pretty easy, just as long as you get up here, of course. And then I guess I can now go plop into the water and do a little timing challenge here. So if you go up to the surface, there's another one of those scarecrow dealios, and you gotta put your hat on there and then get to the middle of that structure because you wanna go and ground pound as quickly as you can to the. Oh, Dory, no! You got in my way! Does it say you could ground pound to the because there's a moon down all the way here? Dari! That was the worst possible time you could have passed by! Why? Why? And that's an easy one too, aside from Dari. I don't think Dari ever got in my way when I tried to get that before. Alright, so get down the middle of this. And I mean about the middle, you don't have to be perfect, perfect, you just need to be. Near the area, Lake Kingdom Timer Challenge 1 is completed. Now I'm gonna go up to that pipe. Remember that 8 bit pipe? Yeah, up over. I think it was this. Yeah, it was this way. I see that little peak of green over there. And zoink, and zoink. We're going in. Yeah! Ah, even the 8 bit music of this is beautiful. <laughs> All right, let's get some notes here. It's all time, so be sure to plan ahead, especially since you're dealing with the moving platform. It should go pretty smoothly, actually. Yeah, there we go. Let's grab that moon and leave through the pipe. Or should we? <laughs> Don't forget the purples. Okay, let's get out of here. Now I go over to the hat on the other oh, hat door, I should say, on the other side. Well, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I didn't know you could develop a skill on being flat. Oh, I guess on my way I can do this now. Remember I said before she was looking for a fish? Those fish and their little round bodies are so cute. I want to see one up close. I'm too nervous to approach one. I wish one would visit me here. Well... Your wish is about to come true, because I'm gonna go get you a fish. Eventually, I just gotta kinda kinda sink down to the bottom here. Hey guys! One one you wanna volunteer? Any any of you? I was shaking the there we go. I was gonna say I'm shaking the Wii not Wii Remote, the Joy-Con, and uh it was not latching on. Oh wait, 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 I gotta be closer. There we go, and you can flop around here all day and all night, but most importantly, so cute! Yes, indeed! Close swings, cuteness! I can hardly stand the adorability! Thanks for coming by, little friend. Would you like a power moon? Sure! <laughs> She's like, oh god, who this, where'd this guy come from? <laughs> Alrighty, now I can use this fish. I, I, I decided not to go by the, the hat. Really cool. What, 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 what am I doing? What am I doing? It's Y to die. Why am I going ZL? I figured as long as I've got a fish, I might as well do this now. I'm gonna go hop down over through here. And she's like, get out of here. Okay, I'm just gonna go down here. <laughs> At least I think I can do this now. I, I, I'm not sure. Ah, good thinking. No air needed. Yes, yes. Uh, you can reach us without the fish, but you gotta really be swift in doing so. Let's put it that way. But anyway, we're down! Oh man, it's Captain Toad! What are you doing here? 
<laughs> how, how did you even... Man, you must be a pretty strong swimmer. Okay. <laughs> Let's go down here and he'll be like... Ah! So I'll just leave the fish behind. And now he'll be all happy. Mario, fancy you you here! That's right! It's me, Captain Toad! I'm traveling in the world looking for my bar moons! So what this back back of stuff? I don't even know how I made it here! Oh, I want to discover this bar moon here! You're gonna have it! Yeah! Let's go swimming, Captain Toad, indeed! <laughs> so quiet here! I wonder how I'll get home! Well, there, there is this, there's this thing called a war pipe. If you've never heard of one of those in the Mushroom Kingdom, just saying, you, you just, just, I can't go in. Just saying, you, know, you could, you, you could try this. Just, just watch me. Look at that, I'm out of here. Oh, then again, he's got this water to deal with. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe it's not so simple for him. <laughs> uh, uh, I think this is the next spot that I wanted to go to with the hat door. Right, right? Hat door here? Or is this just, uh, yeah, hat door here. Then there's another one up top, of course. I'll pop back up there eventually. Aha! This is a really, I mean, there's a really obscure secret moon in this place. You'll see when I get to it here. It's just, just, my hint at this moment in time is unzip everything that you can. But anyway, as you can tell over here, there is a key. Well, there's a lock, I should say, over there, a keyhole. And well, we need we need to locate that key. That is not for the secret moon though, believe it or not. It's well, you'll see. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and make a T shape over here. We're gonna do our T poses to be a proses or something like that. I don't know. And you can see there's some coin stacks back there. But more importantly, we've made a little. A little path here on the way of backseat, okay? Okay, so just keep that in mind. And I don't know if it's actually gonna help me for killing the critters. By the way, down is indeed death here if you should fall off the platform, so try not to, especially when you finally reach that key. <laughs> Dunk! Here we go, and now for the secret coin stash. That's completely optional, but you can go here anyway. And. Hmm. Hmm. Are you ready? Are you ready? Because there's a whole swarm of these critters. <laughs> okay, now here's a key. Grab that key. Moon pops out of there. You don't even have to put it in there, but you do need to get back over there. Get on that. Yeah! <laughs> and that takes care of those guys. But wait, we have still not reached the moon, so don't die on your way back there. Got it? Okay, and I'm gonna actually just play a little bit safer here so I don't have a tiny area, well not tiny area, but a shallower area to jump across when I land over here. And unzip the chasm. Now, you might have noticed that there's that platforming segment over there, but how the poop do you reach that? That's, oh, well, not like that! I switched. But anyway, not like that. It would be, uh... Oh, it poops me back here. But yeah, there is a, uh... There's a certain way of getting to that. You can do some fanciful jumps, but that's pretty difficult, especially in this early portion of the game that someone might come across it, so... They kind of have a different way of getting to it, and it's not something that you are able to see. Let's put it that way. See that little, little thing jutting out of there? Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky there, game. And now you can reach this. But what will we reach if we actually open this up? Well, you're gonna have to find out. Uh, uh, contrary to all the other areas, down is not death here. Yeah, we're still stuck onto the, the zipper, as you can see. <laughs> but anyway, there's a moon over here. Super secret zipper. Oh man, the fog is really thick here. But I guess I guess it's technically not a bottomless pit if there is a platform down here, so it doesn't make sense. But if you think about it, compared to any of the other areas, that sure looks like it's gonna kill you. <laughs> Wait, wait, I'm gonna do some fanciness here. 
There we go. That's a relatively quick way to get back, I guess. Alright. And that's also another way to get there if you'd like to. <laughs> now I'm gonna go up to the other hat, if you don't mind. Which is up to. Well. Oh, yeah, I need to use the flowers. Ah, boopers. I actually can't go just straight up that away. Gotta go up this way first. Well, I shouldn't say that. I, I, as I said before, I can use the cheap, cheap method, the shortcut up here, but. Well. Well, that's a little bit on the tricky side, and this is... We, we want to get things done today. <laughs> Alright, hat number two. Here we go. Ooh, it's Fuzzy Town. And not the ones that you want to sniff. No, 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 no. These are... These are the... I guess you... Are they spiky? I don't know what the poop these things are, actually, that actually hurts you. It looks like that they... Maybe got quills coming from their body or something like that. I've never understood what the poop are the body properties of these sorts of fuzzies. I mean, if they're fuzzy, I you'd think they wouldn't be that harmful, but maybe they're like a, a spiky type kind of fuzzy, sort of like a porcupine. Anyway, those are the last three purple coins. And we are going to wiggle our way across these ledges. Don't worry about Mario losing grip or something like that. His grip is the strongest in the world. He'll never let go. Except maybe if you get hit. <laughs> no, I don't think so, actually. I think you'll just you'll just hold on to it anyway. Yeah, got some little flowery bouncies. And I like to get these if you don't mind, guys. Thank you. Just for the heck of it. Now, elevator time! Literally, elevator time. <laughs> Get, like, really close to the edges of the fuzzies, but not quite quite over to touching the fuzzies. You just want to give yourself a little extra leeway. But wait here. Wait here. Oh, Wait for it. <laughs> wait for it. It's a secret path. And sure enough, there's a power moon up here. <laughs> Jump, grab, and climb some more! Now I'll take the normal path uh, to the regular moon, I suppose, just to show you how that goes. What you're supposed to do here is use the flower and collect the ringy coins along the way. If you, there we go. That is a really bright reflection. <laughs> and the other moon is a go. Jump, grab, cling, and climb. They said some more, but... We got that before this one, so maybe they should have reordered that. <laughs> now, nah, the other one was technically the secret moon that you're not technically supposed to find first, but I kind of did. <laughs> now, there's another little timer challenge over here, which I'll do to finish the parts, I think. Sounds good. Oh! Prepare to do your jumps without a hat. What? Oh! At least I should practice it. Oh, dang it! <laughs> I guess I got triple jump up there too. <laughs> Try it again. <laughs> it's just that the first and last jump on this is the. There we go. No, no, no. Just do, do that and. No, 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 Complete Kingdom Timer Challenge 2 complete. Oh wait, actually, wasn't there a third timer challenge? I should probably... Uh... Or was it underwater? Uh, yeah, I don't remember where the last... Because there was another timer challenge, I think. If I... Or maybe it's not a timer challenge, it's a race later on. Well, anyway, I think what I'll do, just for kicks, as long as I'm looking around, I'm gonna do this. Oh, I want to fix it, I really do, but it's just so heavy. Oh, no! Fix what? This statue-like formation? Well, you know, it looks like that there's something I could put a hat on up there. Oh, look at that! <laughs> so what we gotta do is put that triangle thingy onto that pedestal by flipping around. By the way, try and get out when you're on underneath it like that. You ain't gonna do it. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and 
try to get that flipped around here, if you don't mind. Uh, let's see, this reminds me of those uh, uh, Zelda Spirit Tracks and Phantom Hourglass block flipping puzzles. Let's just see here, I'm just, just, just doing loops until I can maybe get a grasp on what I need to get here. Okay, no, that's incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> I, was I was thinking like I should show you the shortest path, but I'm not gonna make it to the shortest path at this rate. Bunk. <laughs> That's what happens if you do that, by the way. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that's incorrect because this is uh, it's flipped the wrong way. Uh, wait, can I just like go boink, 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 and then flip it a few times this way? Uh. That might work, actually. Hold on, hold on, we might have something here. Yeah, and obviously I forgot how to do this puzzle. <laughs> uh, let's see here. A couple more loops. And we go boink, 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 okay. Yeah, there we go. That took me way longer than it should have. <laughs> Alright, but I did it. It's all fixed up. A successful repair job indeed. Anything else to say before I leave? Oh, you didn't have to do that, but thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for hitting me with your hat too. <laughs> um, as long as I got all the regional coins as well. You know what? You know what? Let's go ahead and buy all the garb. <laughs> Uh, I think the quickest way to get over there would be to enter this way. Here we go. And we're in. Now I can see what they have to buy. Because why not? I just buy everything that's here because I got all the coins. <laughs> Delightful. We know that. You, uh, people have said that exact same set of dialogue before. Alright, let's put on those swim goggles and I'll change that, sure. I think you could actually use this to uh, enter the lock lady dress area as well, if I recall correctly. I could be wrong about that though, but at the very least I know that you can do it with the boxer shorts. <laughs> Put that on the Odyssey, pop this little model inside, and see it's a rubber dory. <laughs> Underwater dome, definitely a place of interest for tourists that can swim, and we are good to go in that regard. And we have new outfit! <laughs> Very fitting for the area. Let's see what we got here. Oh yeah, I guess I should buy my singular moon. As I said, I only buy one moon at each shop. Only one. <laughs> Just for the sake of counting things. You can get up to 99. But I'm only buying one. Uh, I might as well. Sure. Okie uh, dokie. Yes, yes, sir, sure. <laughs> it's just like so I can show how this looks as well before I leave here. There we go. Uh, that looks good. I don't need to upgrade my health or anything like that. <laughs> yeah! I am fashionable indeed, and I've just cleared out basically everything in the shop. <laughs> I think this is more fitting for the area though, so let's go ahead and do our swimwear here, and yes, yes, you don't have a cap, but what you do is you throw your snorkel, and <laughs> that is your cap. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Alright! Woo! <laughs> Now, I wonder... No, wait, actually, no, 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 I'm... before this part gets too long like that other one, I'm gonna end off the part here. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next parts.